A third principle, uh, uh, still about empowering learners, uh, we can call the identity principle. Uh, this is a principle that schools forget about all the time. Think about it, when I want you to learn something, let's say algebra, uh, you have every right to say, why should I learn that? Who uses this? Why would I want to do this, right? That's a crucial question. Uh, what sort of people use this and what do they do with it? That's where identity comes in. The beginning of learning is for me to know who am I going to be? What am I going to get if I do this and learn this? Now, games are very good at creating an identity. Um, they know that you need to know why you're doing stuff and who is doing it. They give you an avatar, they give you clear goals, and a clear sense of who you're going to be. And by inviting you to take on different roles in different games, they invite you to become new types of people. This is what school ought to do. You should see learning science or learning algebra or learning literature as an invitation to try on a new identity with new skills and new goals and new possibilities.